Life is great. I found the boot. It was sitting on top of my head the whole time. And I also found... My teeth. <laughs> you guys like my teeth? Hello? Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are back here in a block burp. And I'm um, sorry if this video goes up a little bit late because uh, I was taking a nap and I slept longer than normal. So, um, but um, yeah, today we are back here in my Blockburg Mall once again. And we're going to be doing uh, yet another store. We are, I think we are almost done with this place, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, here's one thing I didn't know. My plants, as I was working on like the stores and stuff, my plants, they just disappeared. I didn't know they disappear. I thought they just die. I bought uh, a sprinkler here. Hopefully people don't mind their clothes getting wet when they um, walk through this bridge because I need my plants to survive, okay? A lot of you guys have been wanting me to make a shoe store, so I typed in shoe store here and it shows me the amount of people who want me to make one. And wow, that's a lot of you guys. You should make a Foot Locker shoe store. You should make a shoe store. You should add a shoe or van store, a shoe store like a Foot Locker. <gasps> Ooh, it this is also highly requested. So we're going to be uh, building that next, a shoe store. But I have done, once again, some more things off camera. Let me show you guys. First things first, Apple Store. Uh, again, a lot of you guys told me there was this thing called a genius bar and I, I forgot to add a genius bar So that is right here. So this is where like people get their products fixed in case something happens So yeah, it's a genius bar. They don't have a sign for it So I'm gonna have to make my own or something the lounging area is a little bit more decorated now So the makeup store that I was starting over here is once again starting to form a little bit It's not done yet, but this is gonna be a Sephora I had to look up some images of what Sephora looks like because I've never been to one um, It's like black and white themed and and it's pretty interesting. It's really cool. So this has turned into Sephora as highly requested. And I still have to like put some things down. That's coming together. And I think that's about it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Security room. A lot of people are like, where are they gonna go, Peter? There's no door there. There's nothing. I finally added a door. And this is what like, okay. <laughs> Security room's not done either. But it's coming together. So um, maybe there will be a person here. And then maybe a lost child or a lost, like a parent who lost their child could go here like, Miss my son Timmy. Can you find my son Timmy? Can you announce it for him? So then they wait here, and then Timmy gets escorted by like a, a officer in here. Like, no! how you live? Let's go ahead and figure out where we're gonna put this shoe store. So I was thinking like Nikes, but maybe we should just call it the shoe department because we can sell all the brands in one store. So that's why I just call it the shoe department because I've been to a shoe department. There's a store called the shoe department where they sell all the brands. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Someone wanted me to add like a Target or a Walmart in my mall. I don't have room for a Walmart or a Target. I think I'll have to do that on its own plot because I do not have space. People love shoes. So I think I think that's like one of the next biggest shops I'll have to do. Called. So yeah, there's this shoe store in my mall that I go to. It's called Shoe Department Encore. That's what we're gonna make today, guys. Oh my god. Oh my god, I just realized one of my um, railings is not colored the same as the others. I bet someone saw that and they were like screaming at me. By the way, this place is now $1 million. So it's the bills are like 3000 now and my money screams every time I have to pay the bills. But that's fine. No problem. Okay, this is really basic right now, but I'm just going to leave the outside. I don't want to spend too long on there. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and start off with the counters. Yep. This is where you're going to buy your shoes, check out your shoes. And then we're going to need a lot of bookcases or shelving. Oh, wait, these could work, right? I guess we'll have to go with that. Let's just, it's not that bad. We could probably use these. All right. So yeah, shoes, they have, they're just in a bunch of shelves here. Maybe add another one here. Oh God, that's a little bit cramped, but oh well. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, I was picturing like, let's do another one like this. Oh, let's do two. Stack two together, like combine these two together. Okay, not that one. But the ones that are in the middle should be like combined. Oh, we don't have actual shoes, so I'm just gonna have to put like boxes on the top. That's something I also wish we had in this game, like a shoe rack. Of course, we wouldn't be able to wear the shoes, but maybe give us like realistic shoe displays um, or something. I hope they add something like that in the future, like a little shoe rack with some pre-made shoes on there, or you can have like an empty one. But yeah, this is basically how our shoe store is gonna go. It's gonna be extremely easy. This one's just like the Apple Store. We're just gonna need shelves and a lot of boxes because that's what shoe places have. I don't know if I'm saying that too much. Sorry if I'm saying shoes too much. So I'm just gonna put down a bunch of boxes. This might be the shortest build. Who knows? It's very interesting so far. Uh, the coloring in this place is a little bit weird. Okay, so there's also like places to sit down and like try on the shoes too. I gotta of course add these Ottomans, so... 
Maybe we can put those in the middle of the aisle? Yeah, yeah, yeah! <gasps> Just like this. This is perfect. But yeah, so people want to try on the shoes too, so they have to like sit down and put it on before they buy it. So we gotta include these little ottoman seating things, at least two per row or something. Um, maybe another one here. There's gonna be some spacing problems, but oh well. Okay. Yeah, that's about accurate. Okay, and we'll make this leather. We'll make this leather seating. There we go. Ooh, that's not too bad. It's gonna be a little cramped around here, but it's okay. Maybe for people who like need to wait or something. I don't know. I'm just gonna make one giant like couch thing. Is that decent? I hope that's decent. All right. Do I want this tall ceiling? Do I want to do that? Is this dark taupe? Dark taupe is like one of my favorite go-to colors. Okay. Yep. It's dark taupe. I'm going to add more shoe boxes. Don't worry. I just wanted to put some at the top. So the top ones are usually the display shoes. Um, there's of course regular boxes. Okay. Don't worry guys. I know I should have put the boxes in the shelves first and then copy and paste it. That way it'll speed it up. Maybe each row could have a different color shoe box. So we'll just put a bunch of boxes. Uh, only makes sense. It only makes sense. Ooh, wait, that's kind of cool. I'm just gonna copy and paste this shells with a bunch of boxes here because, yeah. Wow! Oh my gosh, it's starting to look like a shoe store, guys. It's starting to look like a shoe store. This is exciting. I was like having my roof on because I like seeing the natural lighting inside and not like the bright sun shining its light inside the store. Oh no, the bills have been paid. That means I lost like 3k right now. Uh, okay, and then I don't really care about how my placements of the top shelves are. We'll just make it look like someone messed with it and then like put it, didn't put it back in the right spot. We'll give it that realistic feel so that way it'll seem like someone was messing with the boxes and stuff. This one could be uh, blue boxes. I don't know what color these could be. Maybe brown boxes. Very nice. Okay, now we gotta do some lighting. What kind of ceiling lights do we want for this shop? Maybe some of these. Okay, that's... Okay, I don't know if I want that. Of course. Gotta make it warm lighting. Gotta do some warm lighting everywhere. Yes. yes. This is a perfect shoe store so far. Oh man, do I have to... <laughs> Let's just dye all the boxes. Okay, dyeing all the boxes one by one because that's just how it's gonna work. But yeah, hopefully they do add a shoe rack in this game someday. If you dye things too fast, it'll glitch and make it seem like you didn't dye it, but then you'll have to fix it. <gasps> it's kind of annoying. A little bit annoying. That's something I've noticed. If you try to dye something very fast, it'll glitch out and won't show that it's colored, but in reality, it is colored. Oh, this is great. This is wonderful. If you play like some really chill music while you're doing this, this could be therapeutic. <laughs> just coloring the boxes. <laughs> I'm so lazy to do this right now because I just... Ugh. That's all I'm going to do for now. I know we have like these to go and these to go, but we'll just leave those as it is. Oh my god, I forgot about these. <laughs> we'll just leave those two as it is. It's very basic right now, actually. I don't know what else they could add to me. Okay, I'm about to go steal some from Sephora real quick. Let me go to Sephora. <laughs> let me go steal some like display stuff. I think we could help this out by putting displays. So let me get rid of these. And we probably do need like paintings and plants just to top it off. So let me add... One random plant there. One random plant here. Uh, maybe some more plants. Oh yeah, that- Ooh, that place looks really nice now. Okay, I do want to change one more thing. Okay, ooh. I like that. Uh, just a lot of coloring, a lot of boxes at to be added, and you got yourself a shoe store and some shelves. Okay, and we're just calling it the shoe department encore because... We're gonna sell all the brands here. All the shoe brands. We can. Oh yeah, maybe a trash can. We gotta add trash cans! <laughs> trash can and the shoe store. Yes, perfect. I'll just put a bunch of random trash cans. But yeah, alrighty guys, our shoe store is finally done as highly requested from many of you. And it's pretty obvious that we needed one. Oh, I almost fell into this pond over here. Good thing I got this barrier. Alright, so let's go inside and it's raining. So let me just, I'll just do one volume. <laughs> Doors. Oh, right. Nice. All right. So here is the shoe store over here. Wow. Shoe store. Look at this. Oh my goodness. So yeah, if you want to try on shoes and you want to buy stuff. Okay. There's really not much to tour around here, but yeah, we just have a bunch of shelves. Oh wait, these are actually the perfect shelves. Just all sorts of different color shoes boxes here. 
Um, you never know what's inside each box. It's kind of like a, it's kind of like a present, secret surprise. Maybe on this display I can add like some logos and stuff. We'll have Nike and then Adidas. I don't know too many shoe brands, but I know quite a bit, a little bit. Puma, Jordans, <laughs> Jordans, Jordan, <laughs> Jordan. Okay, well, yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Do they have like? Okay, I'm just gonna put. I'm just gonna pick that word easy right there. Um, that's all I know. I only know those five things. I don't. I don't wear too many shoes. I wear. Oh, Converse. Oh my god, I f almost forgot. A shoe that I wear all the time is Converse. Oh, Vans. Vans. Vans and Converse. <laughs> I think we'll just call this Famous Footwear because they have a logo for this. Ooh, there we go. Famous Footwear and it sells all the brands. Oh wow, look at these. So yeah, we got Converse, Vans, Yeezys, Nikes, Adidas, Pumas, Jordans. I don't know what else. There's probably a lot more that are so obvious. But yeah, anyway guys, that is basically it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, found it interesting, dumb, silly, inspiring in a way, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And if you guys want to continue watching any other Roblox videos on the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. It is completely free. As always, make sure to leave some more suggestions down below. We have only a couple more shops left. But yeah, thank you guys for taking the time. I really to watch this. I'll talk to you in the next videos. Stay tuned. Stay awesome. Have a wonderful day. Peter Bread signing out. Goodbye, everybody.